FASD uh, stands for Fetal Alcohol Spectrum Disorder. When alcohol is introduced to a fetus, it actually changes the way the brain develops. You know, there are certain things that are common with FASD, but each person with FASD is impacted quite uniquely. It is a lifelong disability. Everyone that has FASD has strengths and has weaknesses. So being able to identify those through the diagnostic process lets people around that are supporting the individual know what maybe they need to focus on more. If you came for a diagnosis, you would see the diagnostic team and then we would make recommendations on who might be sort of involved in your follow-up. It can give us a really good snapshot of how a brain works, what's hard, what's easy, what are our strengths, what are our challenges. We don't know if they have been struggling for so long and they don't understand why. Why am I feeling this way? Why am I having trouble with this? Stigma is really hard with FASD. This is not a judgment-based program. We don't judge anybody for it. We are just here to figure out how this person functions and how can we best support them. They are a person first and their diagnosis comes second. It doesn't define them. It gives us tools that we need in order to support them so that they're successful. And they might be able to one day say, I was diagnosed with FASD late in my 20s and I work hard and now I'm here. To give them the opportunity to know what their disability is, I think is very important.